All right, you know the futuristic family, don't you? Yes, I yes. loved that show when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. I absolutely did too. My mom always said when they were kids, they thought that they were going to be living like the Jetsons in the 2000s. <laughs> and here we are. Close. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. All right, so the Jetsons, they set for life in the year 2062. Did you know that? No. Oh, I did not know okay, that. Okay, so follow me here with this. All right, so here we go. The Jetsons are living in 2062. At the time, George, the father figure, is 40 years old, which means George Jetson was born sometime oh. in 2022, my friends. Wow. That is mind so blown, that, right? So it's possible that we could be living like them. We could be. Okay. Yes. Um, so I think to myself, what would the father of the future want for Father's Day? And I ask this because. All right, so let's watch because when so much is done for him, okay? So we've got this, he's standing there, he's like, where's my shoes? And he pushes a button and the shoes come on his feet, right? And then his clothes come on and he gets his teeth brushed and his uh -huh. hair combed and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so what does the father of the future want? That's a tough question. What are you thinking? Oh, geez. Definitely not. I mean, I could put my own darn shoes on. I don't need anything like that. <laughs> Maybe like a self-driving car. I mean, but those kind of exist but now. But that kind of yeah. exists now. I kind mean, I want to fly. I want to fly. I want like a cool machine that helps me fly. Uh -huh. I'm not a father, but that's what. But that's what you would that's want. Yeah, absolutely. Want. Okay. All right. Well, according to the National Retail Federation, this is what dads are getting this year. Special outings, clothing, gift cards, electronics, and personal care items. The total for spending this year, about 20 billion bucks for Daddy-O. Hey, I gotta tell you, 20 billion though is about the same as last year, which was a record high, so inflation doesn't seem to be shrinking okay. for dads. Okay, all right. I mean, you gotta make sure dad feels the right. love, right? I, I got him a golf shirt. Okay, so, so you got the clothing, one of the things on the list. Mm -hmm. Best Buy gift card. Okay, I've already so told you that the other day. One of the things <laughs> on the list, right? And as I was going down the list, Chilton's going, yeah, that one, yeah, that one, yeah, that one. So he's good with all of them for those of you listening at home. All right. Uh, okay. All right, I got some quick fun facts for you when it comes to Father's Day. July 5th, 1908, a West Virginia church sponsored the nation's first event to honor fathers. But this was like a one-time thing. That was until 1910, a Washington state woman rallies for the first official Father's Day to be celebrated. She was raised by a widower father, mm. and so she wanted fathers to be celebrated. But it didn't become a holiday until 1972. That is 58 years mm. after Mother's Day became a holiday. Which came first, Mother's Day or Father's Day? Mother's Day. Mother's Day. Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. What came first, the chicken or the egg? <laughs> Mom. Ha, ha, ha.